Miss Copy Level 3 explosion call at Oak Tree in Midville Park. Complete heard an explosion in the area. We're also getting another one at 5103 South Lavender. It turns out it is citywide. Area. No I guess it's all citywide right now. Any else clear for level 2, 10, 49, 9, 2, 1, East Shiloh complains that somebody is going around rattling the wrought iron bars to our house. Wire, wiring, they're just hearing it. It's probably also related to the explosion. You don't happen to have any power outages reported up there, do you? That's negative, and I'm on the 21 with DM, and they don't have anything going on that they think would cause this. Jeannie Lane. Complainant heard the booms earlier, said he did shake his house about 10 to 15 minutes ago. Then it sounded like someone was shaking his back door. He said he did not notice anything in the backyard. Talk of several towns in West Michigan today. Mysterious loud booms woke people up and rattled windows last night in Branch and Calhoun counties all the way to Allegan County. I'm just waiting. Where was it? The, was, the sound was coming from um, up there, over there. Like by where, like, Petro. That's scary, man. Especially how it was just like, let's get your hand in here. This could go viral. <laughs> this is scary as hell. Just fucking. There it is. That's a transport. That's a truck. No way. Yeah. Hold your brakes. No way that's a damn truck. That is the truck just went by. That's way too. <laughs> like just listen. Oh my god, that's so cool. Wheels are frozen. Did you hear a loud boom earlier today? Several people heard and felt a loud noise around 1230 Central Time this afternoon. News Channel 7's Tyler Allender joins us live in the studio. And Tyler, is any word on what it was? Ron, with Tendall Eglin and NSA Panama City nearby, we're no stranger to loud booms from time to time. This particular one seems to be a mystery, though, but... I heard and felt it. As of now, there's no official word on the source. Law enforcement doesn't believe it's criminal. Many of you called our newsroom and left comments on our Facebook pages. And here's what some of you said. Barbara was wondering what the big boom was. Debbie said the houses on her street shook. Tiffany was also curious. Enid said she heard what she sounded or what sounded to her like an explosion in the Grand Lagoon area. Houses shook and even tripped the breakers. Now, there weren't any reports of an earthquake, according to the U.S. Geological Survey, and still not everyone felt it. We had fewer, if any, reports from those who live closer to Tyndall, over to Callaway, Springfield, and Parker. But if we do get any leads, we'll be sure and pass them along, Ron. All over Carter County took to social media about a loud boom that shook their homes and workplaces around 10:15 this morning. News 12's Amy Jensen spoke with Air Force bases about what might have caused it. The whole building shook. I felt the boom, and then it it just like rolled, rolled, roared. I was here waiting on a customer, and all of a sudden there was this huge, what I thought was an explosion. Jadine Fackrell was at work when she heard the boom. She says everyone inside at the Oklahoma Pecan Company ran outside. The building, the windows rattled. Um, it, it felt like it shook, although we're on a concrete foundation. 
A public affairs officer with Lockheed Martin tells us they're still determining where the sonic boom test took place, leaving those around Carter County, like Fackrell, who felt it, still wondering. No smoke, no fire, no sirens. Don't know what it was. Imagine for a second being woken up by what sounds like a cannon outside your window. Well, that's how a lot of people are describing a mysterious boom in the Huntington area. When you hear something so loud it shakes your home, you expect you'll find something when you look out your window or start talking to people in your neighborhood. But that's not the case with the booms heard all across Huntington last night. So I ran to the back door and looked out. But I didn't see anything. It rattled the windows, shook the walls, and it jolted the doors. But it didn't leave a trail. What in the world is going on? It's what a lot of people in Huntington have been wondering. All I heard was a big boom. Anytime there's something like this that happens where there's no real evidence to prove where the sound came from. We've heard Jesus is coming. <laughs> um, we've heard lots of things. This is the kind of stuff you see on TV. It's not something I thought we would ever be discussing in our own town. So, I've been hearing some strange noises outside now for a bit. I open the window to show you. It's really strange. Listen. what it is but it's starting to freak me out a bit. I don't like it. It's been happening every kind of 10 minutes, half an hour. But there it is again. I don't know what it is, but it's been some strange cloud formations. I don't know if that's got anything to do with it, but it's freaking me out. I've heard about these noises from other places, but um.
Mysterious boom sounds are reported across the Asheville area. Followed by a very loud boom. And I really felt like the cabin even shook a little. West Asheville resident Naomi Stock says the loud noises woke her up. Stock wasn't the only resident to hear a boom around 1230. Dozens of others took to Facebook and contacted News 13 